You may occasionally need to move things around in Zenkit. Collections between teams, items inside collections, between Kanban lists, or even between collections themselves. It's really easy to do this in Zenkit, so let's get to it. First off, moving collections. Moving a collection couldn't be simpler. You can drag and drop collections within a team to reorder them, or even drag and drop collections between teams. When you move a collection to a new team, only members of the new team and of the collection itself will be able to access it. Moving items within a collection is really simple. You can simply drag and drop them in list, Kanban, or calendar view. Moving items between collections is a little trickier. Because each collection has its own set of custom fields, you'll need to tell Zenkit exactly which fields you'd like to move across and where the data should land. To move an item to a new collection, click on the three-dot icon from the Kanban, Calendar, or List view, then click Move to Collection. Choose the collection that you want to move to from the menu. You can choose any collection in any team. Click Show Field Mapping to start choosing which fields to move. Zenkit will match field types as closely as possible, but ultimately you decide how fields should be transferred. Please note that you can only transfer fields of the same type, so you can not transfer a number field to a text field, for example. If there isn't an equivalent field in the new collection for a field in the old one, any data in that field will be lost when the item is moved. For example, there is no expiry date field or any date field in the materials collection, so when you move the item from the inventory collection to the materials collection, the expiry date on the item will be lost. Once you're happy with the choice, click Move Item. And it's as easy as that. Your new item will show up in the new collection.